Well, as you can see, my gas torch came in. So uh, today we're going to have a look to see if uh, hot brassing works on cast iron. <clears throat> so uh, without further ado, let's uh, fire it up and uh, give it a whirl. Well, it's shiny, but it's not brassy yet, so I'm guessing it still needs some more heat. Well, I'm going to carry on with this for a little while and uh, I'll bring you back in a minute. Okay, well I've given it a few more minutes, so uh, let's have at it, shall we? Let's turn this off. Uh, I'm just going to tie this down. Just needed a bit more heat. Haha! -ha! Awesome! Okay, so basically I'm going to carry on with that and uh, I shall be back in a bit. Well, I'm basically all the way round now, apart from the last spot. That's what it looks like so far. I've just got to hit this this area here, oh, it's a bit warm, and uh, that'll be the top part finished, and then I'll go on to the next band. So let's finish that one, shall we? You see? There we go. I'm really pleased that it works. Uh, the trick seems to be to keep the temperature up, you just uh, lightly hit it again afterwards and then whack it on with the uh, brush and it works really good. I'm just waiting until the uh, brass starts turning dark like it's doing about now.
There we are. That's got it. Oh, bit of a spot that needs a touch up there. So, I guess that proves that you can hot brass cast iron. So uh, I'm going to do the other band, then I'm going to paint the rest of this thing, let it cool down obviously, uh, paint it, and then start assembling the main bits again, I think. So uh, I hope you enjoyed what you caught, saw. Uh, I certainly learned a thing or two. So. Um, Thanks for watching and uh, I'll catch you guys later. Bye bye.